Hello! In this video I will show you how to create residential proxies using the Bluestacks Emulator and iProxy Online service. What are residential proxies? Residential proxies are proxies which are used through a home internet provider, regardless of whether the connection is wired or by Wi-Fi. Any work and visiting sites on the internet will be through the home internet and iProxy service will allow you to connect to your home internet provider from any point in the world. Residential proxies will allow your friends and colleagues to connect to your home internet traffic, and it won't be matter where are they now. Today I will show you on the example of creating a proxy in Ukraine and giving access to my friend who is now in Kazakhstan. These are residential proxies. Well, let's get started with the setup. First, I go to iProxy Online. I have already created a connection in my profile. How to use iProxy you can see in the review. The link is in the description. And as emulator I will use the free program BlueStacks. So, first you need to download the emulator. You can do this at bluestacks.com. Download, install, run it. Now you need to download the iProxy and OpenVPN application for Android from the Play Market. The process is the same as if you install these applications on your Android smartphone. Download and install. I have already done this before, and both of these applications are already installed in my emulator. Now I am running iProxy in the emulator. As you can see, everything is connected in the same way as on smartphone. Now suppose I am in Ukraine, and my friend is in Kazakhstan, and he wants to use my mobile proxy with Ukrainian geolocation. How can he work with my proxy? My friend uses Multilogin Anti-Detect Browser. He set my proxy data, and as you can see, he successfully checked them. He launched the browser, and as you can see, he is using my proxies and connected to my home internet traffic, and it has my geolocation. The local provider is specified and IP. At the same time, his own geolocation, Kazakhstan. He uses the residential proxies that I provided him. On Huernet, we can see that the anonymity is 100%. And now, when my friend will be visiting any sites, they will be seeing that they are visited from Ukraine using a home internet provider. That's how it works. If you have any questions, write them in the comments. And for those who want to understand traffic arbitration, we recommend the excellent resource fsecret.com. There are interesting articles, blogs and all the information you need on this topic, so you can become successful in traffic arbitration. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click like. That's all for now. Bye.